If you've watched the previous steps of how to make this candle holder, here we are with the final product. If you haven't, I encourage you to go back and see how these are made. This is the base plate. This is how the actual candle will fit in to here. Okay, so we made two different parts and they're two completely different processes. This is the actual base that holds the candle stand. Note that the hole is still open in the top and bottom for mounting purposes. We use the same glue and glue in a rivet to cover that screw hole. Now remember when we took care of this and wrapping it around the actual stem, these are two completely different stems. I did two so I had to mark them. I put a punch at the top of here you can see that indicates that this is torch number one and then I put a punch at the top of here to indicate this is the stand for number one because the stand for number two and the torch for two won't fit. So you just basically slide them right in, kind of goes in at a little bit of a corkscrew because of that twist and it locks in.